Okay, good morning, guys. Oh, funny sleeping in this morning. I have not done that in so, so long. Like, for the past, I don't even know. But every, every single morning for, for a long time now, every single day, I've woken up to an alarm, haven't slept in, instantly get up, and I love that. To be honest, sleeping in is not, not something I enjoy anymore. When a few years ago when I when I still did it, it was like oh this is the best thing ever I'd wake up and I just sit in bed watching YouTube whatever now these days it's like I've reprogrammed my head or something either that or it's just a habit now but if I have to sit in bed for a bit sorry if I wake up and then I sit in bed for a bit I it just, it's horrible like I start feeling stressed I just don't like it I don't know how some people can sit in their bed for a few hours so what I mean is I didn't sleep in I slept later so no 4 a.m. wake up today, and that's obviously because I've got a break day today, which is much needed, and I'm looking forward to it. I'm not going to get much of a chance to film a lot today because it's going to be more of a social day. I'm not doing too much work. I'm still going to go to the gym. Actually, I'll tell you the plan for today. So this morning at about say 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock, yes, I'm going to go to the gym with my brother. We're going to do, I'm, I usually have a chest and leg, uh, no, not chest and legs. Legs and abs, legs and abs today. And I'm also gonna try get the 90 kilo bench. I haven't been able to do it this week just because of time constraint and the gym's been too busy, but this morning it should be all right. So we're gonna try that. Then I'm gonna come back, get dressed, go out for coffee. And then I've got a haircut at 11.30. So Nick will come with me for that too. Then I'm gonna come back. And then family friends having a, in, in South Africa, we call it a bri, but it's, barbecue over in america which is cringe name barbecue and yeah we're gonna go over there for a few hours it's gonna be lots of other people there a few of my mates and just gonna chill there for the afternoon and tonight i'm not sure what i'm gonna do i might end up going out i'm not sure it depends on how i feel later but if i do get, go out it's not going to be in the past i've had feelings where i've gone out I felt guilty because I'm. I say to myself, you know what? I haven't earned this. I haven't worked hard enough for this. Or it's been. I go out and I just feel stressed because I'm not working. Like I go out and then as soon as I get there, I'm not having a good time because I think to myself, you know, I could be at home working right now. But I think, <laughs> I think I've worked pretty hard for the last while. Literally, eight to eleven hours every day for the last two and a half months. So I think I've earned it and I think I'll I'll do well. But like I said, it depends on how I feel later. I might not end up going out. But either way, I'm not going to get much time to film today. But what I can do now is go and read the comments from yesterday's video. Because I usually do it at night. But obviously tonight, I will most likely not be at home. So let's do that now. All right, let's have a look at these comments. My favorite tea is Earl Grey. I have a feeling you're from England. Because my mom likes Earl Grey. And she, well, she's not actually from England. But I think it's a British thing to like Earl Grey. I drink uh, Salon tea, Five Roses, Joko, whatever you want to call it. I think it's just called Salon tea. No monk mode and filming the day of fun tomorrow. Should be a good vid. Yeah, honestly, I, I don't think I'm going to film much unless I get a video out this afternoon. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Video out this afternoon and then I'll record later so I don't have to post it when I get home. And then that'll be included in tomorrow's video. So I think that's what I'll do. It's all about balance. Life is a simple circle put more in and get more out i think guys your age really get that and spend their time getting hammered and being lads you'll have the last laugh when you're rich and successful and be smug in the knowledge you've worked your ass off for it uh wait i need to read this again and spend their time yeah yeah absolutely um the way i like to do things is be ba balance is not something you should have all the time so you spend, let's say, 90% of your time with no balance, just being intense on one thing and then 10% where you have more of a balance. But it's not this whole swaying thing, so 90% of the time you're on, 10% of the time you're off. Why would you do that? That doesn't make mathematical sense. You want to be 90% on and then for the other 10% of the time you are still going hard, but you're having a little bit more of a balance. But yeah, a lot of people my age, they, yeah. <laughs> you, you know the story. They go out. They, they go out all the time, and that's all they do. Oh, alien. Do you ever have trouble sticking to your monk mode? 
did you just push through it or were there any methods in particular that made you stay consistent? Did I ever have trouble? Well, I never broke protocol, which I'm quite proud of. I never had a, I never fell off, but there were times when it was difficult, but I just remind myself that, hey, there's other people my age doing monk mode and they're wanting to get the same things that I want and they're not messing up. So I can't mess up because it's like, it's literally just one big competition. So I can't mess up if they're, if they're doing the same things and they're not messing up, I'd be an idiot to mess up. And it's, it's also just a, a mental model I use is, okay, you visualize yourself when you're, when you're older. I want to be this kind of guy. I want to treat life this way. I want to deal with things that way. And then what you do now before you evaluate every decision you make and base it off of what future you would do. I know it's, it's kind of corny, but imagine this like super version of you and you're faced with a bit of a quandary. Do I do this or do I do that? And then you think, what would future super me do? And then, then the answer comes from there. So if, if you're feeling like, oh, I don't really feel like doing this today, then you go, super me would do it. So I'm going to do it. It's going to suck, but I'm going to do it. You have already said this, but what goal do you have in mind for this channel? Yeah, so for this channel, obviously for now, it's just me. It's vlogs, not really. Just recording my life and how I deal with things. Just so when I love to have a record of things, say this worked well, this didn't because of this, and then I can look back on it and evaluate what went wrong. But in future, I obviously want to grow this channel with more of a purposeful reason, not just filming what I do because it's yeah, it's fun and all, but I like to have some meaning behind this. So I'm going to figure out what I want to do with this channel, the direction I want to take it down. It's going to be quite niched, but it's not going to be this self-improvement stuff because there's so much of that out there these days. It's, I'm just getting sick of seeing it. So it's not going to be anything like that, but obviously once I can put more focus onto this channel, that's when it's really going to grow because I don't put much effort into these videos, really. I just record what I do, put it on iMovie, and then get it out. It really doesn't take much effort. So when I do start putting effort in, you best believe it's going to be good. So that's kind of the goal. I obviously want to grow it in the future. It's not something I can focus on right now just because I have other priorities. And when the time does come, yeah, it's going to, all of my attention is going to go towards this channel, but it's, it's like most channels that have one purpose. It's just get other people who have similar views, get them together on your channel, and then you have like an army. So that's kind of what I, that's kind of the direction I want to take this channel. But like I said, I still need to figure some things out because it would be stupid if I just blindly did something. Like I said, I've got other priorities right now. So yeah, cool. Time to go. To actually no no it's only nine in the morning so i'm gonna go to gym in an hour i think what i'm gonna do now is i'll probably get myself some coffee and read for a bit yeah all right there we go we're back looking good i got it nice and short always the best feeling when you get a new haircut it's like unmatched just can't beat it um water break i'm going to read now for a bit and then get going later. I've still got a decent bit of time, so I can pretty much do what I want now, which is cool. Okay, just gotten home. I went out and did some shopping with my mom for this uh, thing we're going to later, but now I need to get some lunch because it's two o'clock and I haven't eaten today. So I think what I'm going to do, <laughs> I'm going to get some KFC. I haven't had uh, KFC in a while, so might as well enjoy it. All right, I'm going to end this video here. It's still early in the afternoon, but I'm going to go enjoy myself. And I won't be able to put a video out tonight because, like I said, I might go out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload this now as a private video and then release it tonight, like normal time. And then obviously in tomorrow's video, you guys will see what happened today. So yeah, see you guys later, tomorrow, whenever. Yeah.